Good afternoon to all. The topic that I am going to be touching upon today is the concept of flow. It is part of positive psychology, it is a construct of positive psychology and you may have heard this word, we use it in normal uh, English uh, that you know I, I feel like I'm in a sense of you know I'm feeling a flow in doing some certain activity or a certain task given to me you get engrossed in it so how do you identify those tasks because flow has been seen to have a very strong link with well-being and it increases the level of your well-being so you need to identify each person should help should be able to identify areas of flow for themselves we all have them so what is it how do you identify and act a task which is in which you feel flow so first uh, first criteria is that you feel very ecstatic when you do that task so you know for example when you when you're involved in that particular activity for example you listen to a very moving piece of music and you just feel ecstatic you get goosebumps you're in sense of flow then you are able to achieve something which has a very high level of challenge and you're able to do it you feel a sense of accomplishment around it and that is something which makes you uh, go into flow and when you're doing a particular thing when you how to identify is that when you're doing a particular thing you are completely engrossed in it you have no sense of how much time has gone by what is it that you you know other other distractions around you and you've just been completely engrossed in that it could be a project it could be you know creating a piece of music it could be any of those things so these are the things which which are which identify uh, which will help you identify flow in your life and if you get a consultation with me I can help you with that in alongside doing a astrological analysis for you so I'm going to be reading some stuff from my book which is my book which is what is right with you test drive positive psychology I have I have a chapter here on flow and I'm going to be reading something from here about how um, how does flow benefit us so benefits of focusing on flow. Why should we focus on flow? So one of the first benefits is it aids in exercising control. So you're able to exercise control over what you want, what you like, what uh, what gives you satisfaction. So one is that. And it also takes you away when you're engrossed in an activity which is which makes you ecstatic, which uh, challenges you and you're able to achieve the challenge and it just it completely engrosses you. It takes you away from negative thoughts. So that's the second benefit. That you should identify areas of flow so that it takes you away from negative thoughts the third is that once you get into flow whether it's a piece of music a, a painting or anything a project you develop mastery because you're going into areas you've seen musicians and artists who just completely have no connect with the world and they're completely engrossed in what they're doing and that is that is what helps them develop mastery of that area Fourthly, it also helps you to enhance, it facilitates personal growth. So it gives you an area, it helps you find an, uh, identify an area in your life where you can grow personally and also connect with others, you know. Once you grow personally, you will be able to connect with others in a better way uh, if you identify areas of flow. And that in turn would lead to the fifth benefit which is you will be able to develop confidence in yourself by mastering a particular area, by uh, you know engrossing yourself with something you will find something about yourself you will find a hidden talent or a hidden strength in you which will uh, which will give you which will boost your confidence and uh, it will help you connect better with others it will contribute to your personal growth and eventually it will enhance your level of well-being and take you away from negative thoughts so these are all the benefits of flow I can help you identify these areas in your life and I'm going to be talking uh, about these uh, different concepts of positive psychology, about astrology in my videos. So do subscribe and if you need a consultation, please visit my website which is www.roshniandlighten.com and you can buy this book which has easy uh, to-do tips for you to uh, use in your day-to-day -day life on how to enhance flow, mindfulness, happiness, well-being and several other concepts, uh, constructs, gratitude, etc. So I'm going to be touching upon these as well. Uh, in my following videos and I would uh, be you know please subscribe have a look at these videos that I upload and thank you so much for watching bye bye